Hello and welcome back to Crypto Mischief. And for today's video, we have one of those special videos that we're going to remember for a long time. We are talking about the KuCoin community chain, the KCC. And what is it? Basically, it is KuCoin. It is their version of the Binance Smart Chain. This is huge. This is gigantic, okay? If you would imagine what it would have been like to find out and join into the Binance Smart Chain in around November or December of 2020, this is pretty much the exact same position that you're sitting in right now. This has been launched for a couple of weeks. It just started building traction yesterday with two platforms that we're going to talk about today. The main focus of today's video is I'm going to show you exactly how to get your funds onto the KuCoin community chain, onto the KCC. The easiest way for you to understand the gravity of today's video is to look back to December or November 2020 and have a check on what the price of BNB token was back then. We were sitting around about $40 to $50 per BNB. BNB in the height of the bull run reached $600 per BNB token. Now, can the KuCoin token, the native token of the KuCoin community chain, can this token replicate the exact same huge parabolic dominating bull run that BNB went on? I don't know. This is not financial advice. I already announced this and the sites I'm going to talk about on my Telegram earlier today. If you want to get into my Telegram, the link is in the description. It is free. KuCoin is sitting just at the moment at about $14. So if you can imagine if you can replicate anything close to the success that the Binance Smart Chain had, that KuCoin as a token is going to be worth a lot more than it is right now in the next couple months. This is not financial advice. Uh, to see this more as entertainment and a tutorial today because what we're actually talking about is how to get your funds from the Binance Smart Chain into the KuCoin community chain. We're going to do this. At the moment, there's only one way. As soon as I find another way, I will announce it in my Telegram, for example, at Bridge. The only way to do this as of today is to get onto KuCoin and buy the native token there. I'm going to buy some with BNB today and transfer it over to the KuCoin community chain. And then we're going to look at a couple of the new dApps that we can use on this new blockchain. Exciting stuff, I know. I'm going to make this as quick and succinct as possible. Let's go! KuCoin community chain is a high performance and decentralized public chain built by KuCoin for all community users. Developed and based on Ethereum, the purpose is to provide the community users with a higher speed, convenient, and low-cost blockchain user experience. KuCoin Community Chain, KCC, will have the following characteristics. It is fully compatible with Ethereum ERC-20 smart contracts. A KSC, KuCoin token, will, will serve as the gas token for the blockchain. A block every three seconds results in faster transaction confirmation and higher chain performance. Than the Binance Smart Chain? We shall see! Proof of stake authority, consensus algorithm, high efficiency, security, and stability. So they are making some big claims here. KuCoin token is sitting here today. At, it has already pumped 84% on the week on this news of the launch of the, of the blockchain. It is 78th in market cap with a market cap of 1 billion at the moment. Can this go up a lot further? I think so. Not financial advice. If we look at the all-time high of KuCoin, that would be back in the heady days, of January 2018, where it touched $20. So we are not even yet at the price of $20. In the previous bull run, back in April, it did reach almost $20 too. We are still $6 short of their all-time high. I think it is an easy reach to say that, that KuCoin will reach its all-time high in the very near future with the bullishness of this news. Here are the places we're going to look at. We'll be looking at the PooCoin of the KCC, which is CoffeeSwap. This coffee swap token has exploded in the past couple, uh, past couple days. Really, uh, it has just gone parabolic. And we have here KuSwap, which is the pancake swap of the KCC. We are going to look into both of these sites after we set up our wallets. You are going to need a MetaMask, okay? And we are going to need, for my tutorial, we are going to use Binance Smart Chain going into the KCC. If you are not set up on the KCC yet, all you have to do is go to KuSwap Finance, link in the description, 
have MetaMask set up and go to connect. It will then automatically add you with a KCC RPC. So then you can use it easily on your MetaMask. It's that simple to set it up, okay? Then all we need to do is we need to get some KuCoin token. If you already have KuCoin token in your KuCoin account, then congratulations, this is gonna be very simple for you. You can skip this step and go to the next part of how to move it into your MetaMask. Uh, for many people, they don't use KuCoin. We are going to talk about how you set up an account quickly and how you buy KuCoin. I'm buying, like I said, with BNB. So I will need to change my MetaMask back into the Binance Smart Chain. Popping over to KuCoin, link in the description. I set up this KuCoin uh, about a year ago and I've never used it. I used it yesterday to buy some tokens, but before that I'd never used it before. Uh, I did not KYC into this. I have only put in my phone number and my email address and I started to KYC, then it said no, but I can still buy on here, so it's quite good. If we want to buy, you would set up a simple account using your phone number and your email, right? And then you will be able to sign in. For example, here I am here. What we need to do is we need to deposit some BNB into our KuCoin account. So we would go to this assets and then main account deposit and withdraw. We are looking to deposit. We search for the token BNB. Here we are. Click on that. And we have here on the right deposit. So we we first we have to choose where our BNB is going to go. We're going to be changing it into KuCoin token. So we're going to go straight into our trading account. You read and understand the risks. And then we need to say we have two choices here. We have BEP2, which is the Binance chain. Yeah, the centralized exchange token. And then we have BEP20, which is the Binance smart chain, the one that we're going to be using, right? So we click BEP20, Binance smart chain. And we just have to copy this address here. That is the address we'll be sending our BNB to. We go to our MetaMask. So here I, I'll take 0 0.6 BNB. Send, take the address, confirm the address is the same. It is 0.6 BNB. This will not take very long at all. While we're waiting it to send, uh, let's just quickly have a look at the KuCoin community chain Twitter. I suggest you add these guys here. 6,000 followers, still very small, yeah? Like it's, we are extremely, extremely, early here. Here we're talking mainnet launch, which was just two weeks ago. Great to get into this before the masses actually fall into it. Yeah, we can build a position and start stacking some KuCoin, getting ready for the mass adoption that hopefully we will see. Okay, after about two minutes, our BNB arrived. So now what we need to do is we need to trade. We go to our trading account. We can see here we have the token has arrived right here. The way KuCoin works is you have a trading account and a main account. Okay, that's why I sent it into the trading account. Once we've purchased our KuCoin token, we're gonna to have to move it back to the main account to get it out of KuCoin. This is how this uh, platform works. So we are going to trade now. So we go up to here to trade, spot trading. If you if this is your first time here, I know it's a lot of information and numbers, don't be scared. What you need to do is go up here to the top and we have Bitcoin USD and we just need to change that to BNB and the coin that we're wanting, KCS. And you can then come down to this part here. We pop up to spot. We go to market. We just want to buy straight off, right? And we want to take 100% of our BNB and we're going to sell for the best market price we can get. Voila, done. Next, we need to move back. So we click here, KuCoin. Then we need to go into our assets. In our trading account, we're going to have this KuCoin token, 12 of them. We are then going to transfer them into our main account. Transfer all into the main account. And then we need to send them out. So we go back to our main account. We find our MetaMask. The address on your MetaMask is always the same, no matter what blockchain you're on. But just for peace of mind, you can just move it to the, to the KCC. Click on this to copy it. Find the KuCoin token and withdraw. We are then offered two choices. We have ERC20 or KCC. We need to change it to KCC. If you do ERC20, it's going to move into the Ethereum network and it's going to be very tricky to get that into the KuCoin community chain. So go KCC. Wallet address, paste that there. We go max and we confirm. There is no fee currently on moving your KCC. You will then have to verify your details. Uh, I'm going to skip this so that you don't see how I do it. And successfully and almost immediately, as you look into your MetaMask, you will see 
your KuCoin token arrive. Or simply pop into something like KuSwap, where we will be able to connect our wallet. And there you are. Your funds have now arrived into this new blockchain and we are ready to roll. Nice. <laughs> Okay, this will be the end of this video. Please put a like and subscribe on this if it was helpful for you. My next video in this playlist is going to be talking about the different platforms and Moonboy tokens that I found on the KuCoin community chain. All right, thanks. Don't get wrecked.